We all get one vote and nobody wants to have their vote counted less than once or more than once, I believe. And so, you know, to me, voter integrity is the very center of our ability to govern in the way we govern in the state of Tennessee and our nation. And there's two sides of the coin. There's access and there's integrity. And there are some people out there who would choose to sacrifice security and integrity in popular opinion. And just imagine the outcry that we're gonna see if on either side of the aisle in the next election, they feel like the, the election infrastructure was bought and paid for by a wealthy individual or group. If you don't prohibit that, it allows for a third party organization or a wealthy individual to come in and target how to fund election administration in different parts of the state. And the last thing any of us I think want would be a wealthy Republican, Democrat, or Independent trying to shape the overall results of the election. And we have the ability and the responsibility as election officials across our nation, especially in Tennessee, of making sure that it's a place where it's easy to vote, but hard to cheat. And I think Democrats and Republicans and Independents all agree on that. They want to believe that there's a level playing field, and there should be a level playing field. Well, you know, in Tennessee, voters have confidence in the electoral process. And I, I can't tell many people have come to me, both Democrats and Republicans, and said, gosh, we had a smooth election here. Things seem to go well. And so what I don't want to get lost in the shuffle is that our laws worked. Now, we did do a couple of things during the last legislative session. Number one, we banned private assistance for election administration. The second thing we did was we also passed a law that requires watermarked absentee ballots which, you know, the biggest concern I think a lot of people don't talk about is once bad ballots get in to the batch and mixed with good ballots, and I say good ballots, I mean eligible ballots, legitimate ballots, then that creates up to your voter fraud. And once they're in together without proper watermarking, you can't catch those. In the Secretary of State's office, our job is not to run a Republican election, and it's not to run a Democrat election. It's to run an election where every citizen feels like their vote was counted once, no more, no less, and they feel like it was done with the highest levels of integrity. And whenever people hear things and they believe the playing field wasn't level, then that's what causes an erosion of public confidence. And one of the things that we're really focused on in Tennessee is making sure that they understand it's never been easier to vote in our state, it's never been easier to register to vote in our state, and we want to make sure that every eligible Tennessean has the opportunity to cast their vote.